All right, welcome, welcome, welcome once again to the first ever episode three of Exchange Games Live. And this is a special one because it's the one right after Mother's Day. So I want to take a moment to just thank all of the mothers out there. Mine especially. Uh, I got to use my Traeger that I told you guys about that I got at ShopMyExchange.com and I grilled my mama some chef's kiss ribs. It's fantastic. I loved it. We had a great time. Not only got to spend time with my mother and my father who came out, but also got to spend time with uh, my girlfriend's mother and her parents and her grandmother. We had a great Sunday. I hope you did too. I was doing some math very poorly right before the show, so I'm not going to get into like my numbers. But there's three very specific moms that I want to give a shout out to. And I know I'm late, but it didn't make sense to do it last week. We're closer to Mother's Day right now. So I wanted to give a shout out to all those mamas out there that raised service members like my mom. I want to give a shout out to all the moms out there that, that married into the military or a spouse and a mom and are out there doing all this stuff uh, a lot of the times by themselves. And then I also wanted to give a shout out to the very rare, and this is what I was doing that math on, to the very, very rare mom veterans. So if your mom served, like I said, I wish I had, it was like half a percent of the U.S. population. Don't quote me on that because that's where I was saying my math was getting wrong. But it's, if your mom served in the military, please do me a favor. Give her a shout out in the, uh, in the comments below. I want to send her a message. I want to say thank you. And, uh, but I just, I just, I just, those are the three groups of moms. And like I said, all moms are special. And I want to shout out, send a shout out to all the moms out there, even my coworkers that are moms. I see Julie's out there, Sandy's out there, Leah's out there, uh, Armad Shelly, she's a mom. So I'm just so excited for all of you. I hope you guys had a wonderful, wonderful Sunday. And remember, that's just the day that we use to celebrate. But like I said, every day should be Mother's Day. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much. With that being said, hey, Frank, what's going on? How are you? Happy Mother's Day to Michelle, by the way. Uh, Anne says, my vet husband is smoking ribs right now. Okay, so here's the thing that I learned. Uh, my girlfriend, if she's on, she'll, she'll chime in on this. Before anybody, before any man turns 40, he needs to either do one of two things. He needs to either A, become a World War I history buff, or two, learn to smoke some meats. So I learned to smoke meats before I turned 40. So that was, that was my thing. So some, some guys go the other way. But it seems like that's the trend. You either learn World War I history or you learn how to smoke some meats. Oh, you're welcome, Julie. You're welcome. But yes, it's a true shout out to all the moms. But let's get to gaming. Um, before we do that, one more, one last thing. I do guys want to encourage you, and we'll talk more about this later on in the show. But check out the links in the description. Um, I know Mother's Day, if you still need a gift, they're there. But like we have Father's Day just around the corner. We have some insane links. Um, we have, the L, we have some LG like gaming monitors, some TVs on sale, uh, the the holy grail of uh, computers, the iMacs are on sale, so we have a link for that as well. I'm, I'm looking at two of them right now, the 27 inches, they're insane. Um, and then there's also some some hard drive space, but take a minute at some point and, and click on those links if you're if you're looking for those those gift ideas for either Father's Day or a birthday coming up. Um, we have some insane links, and they're going to be. I think Shelly's going to put them in the comments as well, but they're also in the description. Um, I'll go over more detail here a little later on in the show, but I just want to make sure that you guys were reminded that it's there for you guys. So um, I believe there's about five or six of them this week, and um, oh, and the Mac Mini. The Mac Mini is there's a link for that as well. So check that out. There she is. There's Amanda. See, she says indeed. She knows. She knows. But this week, we're playing one of my all-time, no, not one of my, my genre of game. About 10 or 12 years ago, I decided that I wanted to get out of the first-person shooter genre because it was just going over my head. I'm not very good at them. The Call of Duties of the world, the battlefields of the world. I wanted something different. And I came across somebody who was playing something called a roguelike. And I had no idea what that is. Um, and I learned and basically what it is. It's just a simple. It's a simple game uh, But it changes every time so we as we play today. We're gonna die probably 
30 times and that's the point is that you get better and you upgrade as you go the the game is the same but the level is different every time you play it so you'll understand more once we get into it but this is called rogue legacy 2 i played the first rogue legacy never beat it because like i said i'm not good at these games i just really really enjoy it uh again we've uh y'all y'all let me know if uh my levels, if I'm too loud or if the game is too loud. I've turned the music down for copyright reasons, so uh, you, you probably won't be hearing much but like some wind noise right now. But if my levels are okay, just like Pac-Man. Julie, like Pac-Man. It's, it's, it's similar to Pac-Man, but imagine, but imagine if every time you went to Pac-Man, the maze changed. Like every time you die and you came back, it was a new maze. So you're still playing Pac-Man, but you have to learn different routes. So that's what we're looking at. Shelly says my volume is fine. That's the sweetest thing anyone said to me all day. I appreciate that so much. So we are going to... You know what? Uh, I was checking levels and stuff, so we will just continue the legacy. I haven't played it. I just was checking levels to get through it. So here's where we pick our character. We can either pick from a ranger. We can pick from a knight. And we can pick from another ranger. Now the difference between these guys, if you look, is they all have a different um, ability. And then if you look down there in the traits, we have to figure out what those are. But those are normally some kind of negative thing or something about it. Like the food in this game is some kind, sometimes a, a chicken leg. And if your guy is vegan, <laughs> he has the trait of being a vegan and eats a chicken leg, it's not going to heal him. It's actually going to hurt him. So uh, sometimes, but we don't know what a lot of these do. Endomorph. If anyone knows what an endomorph is, please let me know. Antique. We're just going to go with the knife. Nice, nice safe bet. Sword and board. So please, guys, in the comments, please uh, let me know where you're from, uh, where you're listening from. If you served, I'd love to hear your years of service. Uh, every, every week we have somebody come by, and it's always good to have a conversation about where they were and what they were doing. And uh, talk about video games. Like I said, video games with me have a uh, kind of a long-standing uh, kind of intertwined relationship, the military and me. Go ran Okay, Dad wants me to go Ranger. Fair enough. Fair enough. I should have. I should have. So we will. We don't have enough money to upgrade anything, so we will just move right along. I did say into morph. If you can tell me what that means, Amanda, that would be great. <laughs> Yes, I will. I did see on one of the things that like, you can have the trait of being colorblind. And then, like, the trait of being black and white. <laughs> so I thought that was that was that was pretty funny, and that was pretty clever. So, um, like I say every week, guys, if you haven't um, had a chance, this game is almost impossible to talk. But we can make it happen. We can make it happen. Um, if you haven't had a chance, go to shopmyexchange.com slash vets and make sure you get verified. Um, so you can so you can actually click on these uh, click on these links and utilize them. You gotta get an account. Um, and so once you do that, it's super easy. And I believe Shelly told me last week that if you're having any kind of issue at all, um, make sure that you are um, you can send us a. You can either call the customer service line, or you can also just send us a message here on uh, on Facebook, and we'll make sure we get you the help that you need and the assistance that you need. Higher percentage of body fat, less muscle. That's what an endomorph is. Okay, fair enough. We are we are, we are taking some damage, but that's okay. That's okay. We're supposed to die. Best ever do it. We are the best to ever do it. So this game just came out. We are playing this on the Xbox Series X. Um, it is only available on the Xbox Series X and PC. Or you can email customer relations at aphis.com as well. Uh, getting verified. So again, that link is shopmyexchange.com slash vets. And you can email customer relations at aphis.com if you're having any issues. Send us a message here on Facebook or you can call the customer service line. But it's super easy, and I would encourage everyone to do it. Like I said, it's near and dear to my heart. Um, I did. Uh, I was in the Army from 2004 to 2015 and got out of the service and without the exchange and without... Um, 
closed out that piece of legislation allowing them to open up online shopping to all veterans, I wouldn't have a, a tax-free option in my life. But now we do, and I want to make sure you guys have that. And if you have it and you know somebody that doesn't, uh, please, by all means, spread that word, and uh, let's get as many people verified as, pros as, as possible. It's a, it's a, uh, it's definitely a uh, benefit that you earn. It's, de it's a benefit that you earn, so you might as well take advantage of every single thing you can do. So, uh, I encourage you all to do so. It's super easy. It's super easy. Um, but again, like I said, I've been playing roguelike games like, uh, like this for uh, probably 10 or 12 years. Uh, my first game, there was a game called Binding of Isaac, uh, which was really my, my first intro into... Uh, into the genre, and then I moved on to uh, like deck building roguelike, which are kind of the same thing, but you just utilize um, like deck building, like 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 oh. And uh, one week, uh, if we if we if we have the time and this keeps going, I'll be sure and introduce you guys to some of those some of my favorite games as well. Uh, I kind of like some of the non-traditional games. I, lo I love me a good AAA game and a good popular you know sixty seventy dollar game, but sometimes you can find some hidden gems in these little nineteen ninety nine twenty dollar games. So. We just need to find out where exactly we are headed. It looks like we need to go up, maybe to the right. Down. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That's what we're looking for. So can anyone tell me anything special that they did on... Oh, and then Shelly just dropped the links in the... So if you don't see them in the description, you can see them uh, in the comments for sure. Uh, but please let me know if you guys did anything special for your mother. Uh, like I said, it was great to see mine. She doesn't live far, so I get to see her quite often, which is a, which is an actual blessing. Uh, but it was nice to have her over at the house and uh, cook on my Traeger. You know, I'll take any excuse to, to, to grill up some ribs for sure. Which reminds me, which reminds me, uh, tomorrow we have a beauty live. Is that correct, Emily? With philosophy. So any, oh, that was it. That was it. All right. So, so, but we do have a beauty live tomorrow with philosophy, and I'm super excited about that. I learn something with those beauty lives every time they have it. Uh, that's going to be at noon. So all of you mothers that are watching, please tune in at noon to that Beauty Live. That's great. And I don't know if you guys caught yesterday, but Roy Montez had a great workout um, with Captain Bush, which was a new face for me to see. So that was awesome. So again, guys, you have Roy uh, every Monday at 11 doing the fitness stuff. You have me every Tuesday night at 7 doing the, uh, doing the gaming thing. And then Beauty Lives and Chief Chats are happening all the time. You just have to keep an eye on them. So uh, there's a lot of exciting things going on here at the Exchange Facebook page, so we hope you guys stick around. I did die, Julie. Did, I did die. I did die. I'm going to, like I said, that's kind of what these games are. So once you die, you will pick, you will now pick an heir. And so you will you will you you will pick your heir to go on through, and then as the game goes on, they'll they'll pick up traits um, from the ones that came before you. So uh, for my dad who is watching, hello, dad. We're gonna go with the ranger. Yes, Shelly, I actually worked out with Roy. I work out with Roy every Monday. I make it a point. It's part of my routine. Every Monday, eleven o'clock. That's where I'm at. Laptop in hand. I can't work out in front of people. I look funny, though. I look funny when I do it in front of people. When I do it with just me in the room and Roy in the laptop, 
I look like a stud. So here we are upgrading our castle, and as the game moves on, we're going to be able to, uh, we're going to be able to, uh, upgrade new care or get new characters get more health and this is how we get stronger and we progress further and further and further into the game so as we move on we should be getting stronger and stronger and stronger and being able to go that's not always the case because sometimes they throw some curveballs at you but we will just see um, we have 190 gold left uh, so we can go ahead and get us a Valkyrie or no we can get the Academy Afford anything else? There we go. Sorry, I had to figure out what we could afford and what we couldn't afford. All right, and then here we go. So now you'll notice that we are now. Looks like we're a mage because we unlocked it. So, Dad, next time I'll get you the ranger. <laughs> Alrighty. And before we start this run, I do want to go into a little bit more detail. Um, if you guys are looking for those gifts, now that I have it pulled up for you guys, I want to talk about it. I don't have it to pull up but if you guys use those links uh, one of them is for um, a bunch of LG gaming monitors um, the LG gaming monitors are insane um, one of them we have a one of the curved uh, monitors on sale um, then we have the 34 inch curved monitor on sale which is just sick I wish I had like three of those in here that would be a new world uh, and then we also have the uh, the ultra gear um, what is that one? Oh, the FreeSync uh, HDR monitor is on there as well, as well as the 29-inch ultra-wide. But all of them are on sale, or at least most of them are on sale. Uh, so please check that out if you're in the need of any kind of monitor. Uh, also, we have the Toshiba um, external drives, anywhere from one terabyte to two terabytes. Oh, four terabytes. Um, but a lot of those are on sale as well. Um, if you're in need of a, of a laptop, the Dell Inspiron laptops are on sale, the 15.6 inches, uh, and as well as Hisense TVs like... If you need a TV, uh, I would highly recommend clicking on that Hisense link. Um, they are not a lot of money <laughs> for some big TVs, so check that out. As well as, like I said, the Mac Mini and uh, the mother of all, uh, the iMac, the 27-inch with Retina display. Uh, all those links are in the description below, also in the comments, so uh, please check those out if you get a chance. Hey, what's going on, Abid? How are you, sir? I have the 20 cents. And Christine says she has the 27-inch LG. That's amazing. That's a fantastic monitor, especially those ultra-wise. And I know when the curved screens came out, um, a few, I mean, it was probably like a decade ago that the curved TVs came out, and then the curved um, gaming monitors started coming out. Some people have some insane setups when it comes to that stuff. So uh, please check those out if you get a chance. Everyone's probably, hopefully, already taking care of their mother this year. But like I said, Father's Day is right around the corner. Uh, so, uh, if you need to be, we're going to be here every week, and I'm going to try and have those, I'm going to try to have some interesting links for you guys every, uh, every week. Did, uh, did, did Matt did Matt take care of you for Mother's Day? I heard you guys were out of the pool. Uh, <laughs> that seemed like a room I don't want to go in just yet. That seemed a little scary. Okay, what do we have here? Uh, gain a blessing of strength as a cannon. Press to swing your cannon. Hold to aim and fire your cannon. Dash always. Okay, we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. Pool day. You know that seemed to be a running theme. We had uh, we had, when we were doing the grill thing. We had pool day as well. So uh, Mother's Day seems to be like the really for me the first day that the pool is actually kind of like viable. I'm a, I'm kind of a, I'm kind of a baby when it comes to have, like cold pools. Like I don't think like. It has to be like mid-May at the like 
earliest is I'm going to get in it. I, I, kids can get in it starting in April, and I do not understand it. But Oh, this is neat. I've never seen that before. It's really like a melee weapon. Also, if we hold it down, it can a cannon. Very cool. Very cool. ever do it. Best to ever do it. So, like I said in previous uh, broadcast, uh, I was a uh, I was a, a journalist in the Army. I was a president of the Army. I wrote papers in the Army Times and uh, the, the Victory Times and, you know, all in 18th Airborne Corps, or the Fort Bragg paper, the Paraglot. I just wrote, I just wrote stories. Went around different units, covered them down. But one of the coolest things I ever did was, um, it was Mother's Day, one of the years I was deployed. I was just a private, you know, E2 or something like that. And I wrote a, um, a Mother's Day article, and my mother uh, has that article hanging up in her house, like to this day. And so every time we walk in, I always see it, and it, it always makes me happy that she kept it all the years. But it's all really nice and everything. So that that always means a lot. So this Mother's Day is always good. Like I said, it's. It's a special time for, for all mothers, but I just have a special place in my heart for uh, you know, those mothers that, you know, like I said, raised people that ended up being soldiers like me, or uh, or veterans themselves, or, or military spouses. Um, things that they do and the things that they go through is very much appreciated. And I know it's sometimes easy for us. Uh, to ever do it. Team party at my pool? Well, it isn't my pool. It is the girlfriend's pool. So we'll have to, you know, Amanda will have to chime in on that for sure, but I don't think she would mind too terribly much. Unless we go to Christine's pool. I've been to Christine's pool. Christine's pool. That's a good pool. That's a good pool. Alright, alright. We're going to keep going here. I mean, we've only died. We've only died once. I expected to die 30 times, so I think we're doing better than I thought. Gotta find our way through this. It looks like we need to go up and maybe down. All the way down. tried we tried we did indeed try so if you are listening and you are a gamer which i hope you are i hope you are we're trying to build a community here um but if you are a gamer please let me know what you're playing right now it wouldn't be a uh, it wouldn't be an exchange games live if i didn't in some way shape or form complain about um the fact that uh i am 200 hours into elden ring and i am just i, I don't know anymore i don't know anymore i'm at I'm at a boss that just can't be beat, uh, but I've said that about every boss that I've come up to. I just don't know at what point I'm going to, uh, I'm, I don't know at what point I'm just going to accept it and, and, and move on. So, um, but having a great time with that. Still playing Wonderlands uh, that we played last week. And if you guys ever want to bring any of those, uh, any of those games back, uh, we, can we can always give Star Wars another try. Uh, we can also uh, we can also give Wonderlands another try. I just thought this was interesting. This would be something a little different. Uh, maybe a game that a lot of people haven't heard of. Um, this game is twenty four ninety nine in the Xbox Store, and I believe also on uh, PC, which is a great opportunity for me to tell you that you guys can get that stuff if you go to shopmyexchange.com. You type in gift cards. Make sure the little email delivery receipt is checked in the top left. Uh, with that, you can bring up all of the all of the subscriptions and gift cards that we sell. 
Xbox is on there, uh, PlayStation Network is on there, Nintendo is on there, uh, Google Play is on. But all those, all those gaming, uh, all those gaming stores, you can you can load up your uh, you can load up your card with us using your military star card, and then uh, you can go back. You know, you'll get a code delivered to you, and just like everything else, you put that into the Xbox store, and you can uh, you can purchase all these games. So, win win. I agree. I agree. We need. We need to get someone smart that knows how to make Facebook polls and see what game we want to play next. I think that'd be a great idea, Christine. That'd be a fantastic idea. Take a lot of pressure off of me because I think that this game right here, this is a little bit of a, uh, a little bit of a, a uh, selfish. We need to get learn. So this right here, so this skill right here, learn from your ancestors' past mistakes and gain permanent bonuses for dying. So now we'll be able to take. I believe we'll be able to pick traits. Uh, from the ones that came before us that died into our new characters that we can kind of build our characters on. So I think we definitely... But yeah, I do think a poll would be a great idea um, for a video game. There's a couple games that we have in the hopper that I want to try that I just haven't played yet. I hear that um, Hot Wheels Unleashed game is really, really, really good, and I do have a code for that. Um, so we might try that for next week. And we can also try, um, if, as, long as, I have, uh, as long as I have the game, and uh, have the code for it. We can try a couple games to stream. It doesn't always have to be just the one, uh, just the one ring. Oh my God, Elden Ring boss fight. <laughs> yeah, that would be a stream for sure. Just me and Godric going going toe to toe. That that would be that would be uh, that that would be one heck of a live stream. I agree. Ryan's down with some Hot Wheels. The Hot Wheels Unleashed. I know it sounds funny, but so does Lego Star Wars. These games are actually pretty awesome. And if you thought Star Wars looked good, uh, the Hot Wheels Unla Unleashed game looks... I, well, I'm not going to say it looks better, um, but it does definitely look just as good, I would say. So, Okay, so we have uh, we've leveled up here. And here we go. We are the Archer. We're not going to worry about the Blacksmiths or the Enchantress just, just yet. And we're just going to move on to run number three. <laughs> Like I said, we uh, the map changes every time, except I don't know if this one changes. So here you go, Dad. First enemy. Not today. In the air. Oh, he kind of floats. So we can probably use that to our advantage. Guys that chase you down, those are the tough ones. There we go. This guy goes up here. Go grab this guy over here. Quick. It moves at that. It moves at just that perfect speed where you think you can sneak one in, but you can't. We'll get better. We'll get better. We're about halfway dead already. Just fine. Oh, he got killed by the door. Don't think you can kill these things. There we go. Okay. Half, of the, half of these games is just about patience. Just about patience. layout of this is old school. I like it. Yeah, it is old school. But, you know, a lot of these games they kind of make a comeback on the last little bit of it. It kind of has that kind of Castlevania kind of thing to it. That's really cool. bad run. That was a bad run. They're not they're not all gonna be great. They're not all gonna be great. So let's try let's go back to the sword board. This is what we were best at. This is what we were best at. I should probably read the traits from now on, but whatever. It's okay. 
But just a reminder, if you are just getting here, uh, I would please check the, uh, if you would just check the uh, the links in the description, some fantastic links in there. We just went through them. Uh, the, the highlights of them would be the gaming monitors and the uh, the, the iMac retina display as well as the, the TVs. So please check those out. Uh, much appreciated. Um, like I said, Father's Day just around the corner, so we have some great gift ideas. But we're going to have these links every week on, on the show as well. If you aren't verified, uh, please go to shopmyexchange.vets and uh, hit that little, it'll be a red. You know, I can show you, I think. Was it? Oh my gosh, she's the best to ever do it. Look at that, look at that. And I practice this too. The button is right there. It's like I'm a weatherman. I always want to be a weatherman. So you hit that red button, get verified at Shop My Exchange, and they're just going to ask you a few simple questions. If you have any issues whatsoever, uh, you can email customerrelations at aphis.com. You can send us a Facebook message or customer service representatives are standing by uh, to always assist you um, with anything that you might need. So uh, there's no excuse. Pass that link along. Uh, that's shopmyexchange.com slash vets, and we can get back to the game. Look at that. Best to ever do it. Best to ever do it. Okay. So we have 325 gold. I'm thinking we need some more. Can't get any more health. I don't think we can get much of anything. No, that was a bad run. We don't get any. No soup for you. No soup for you. All right, I can do that, Amanda. I can do that, Amanda. How about we turn, we turn the game down just ever so slightly? Tell me if that. Tell me if that helped. Tell me if that helped. Wait till we get some explosions going. But we'll do a few more runs of this, guys, and then, um, like I said, run down those uh, run down those links real quick one last time before we go. Before I tell you all uh, good night and farewell, but stick around. I think this is going to be a good run. I have high hopes for this one. But we might have a little radio silence, and that's okay. We're going to do a little, 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 uh, little of this. Okay. Well, okay. Didn't work out quietly as planned, but it wasn't bad. It wasn't too bad. We got a two for one. We got hit once. We hit two of them. What's he gonna do? No problem. No problem. We can cheese this guy. He's not coming down. We're moving on. We're moving on. You hear a thousand whispers, but can't make out a voice. It's a little creepy. It's okay. ever do it. Not like this. Done it. And so this gold is what gold we're using to uh, upgrade our castle and get new uh, get new abilities, new characters, new uh, new NPCs, all that good stuff. So I wonder if we can hit this I don't understand that right. <laughs> I don't understand what they want us to do. So we're gonna go the opposite direction. Oh, this seems this seems much worse. He who dares wins though. Nope. Oh! <laughs> Alright, 
That was almost really sweet. Yeah. Got one. So many things. I guess we shouldn't even really worry about these, but we're gonna, we might have to come this way again, so I might as well try to get a couple of these. You know what? Fair enough. You win. Oh, this is the boss. We were so close. We were so close. But that was a boss. I don't feel so bad. Or a mini boss. I'm sure that wasn't the boss, but that, he, had, he had a health bar. He had a health bar. Bob, I want an army knights like him. So close. I know it. I know it. I know it. I think I think the knights are character for sure. I think at least mine. I think the knights are. Okay, so this guy is prismatic spectrum. We don't know what that means. Strike like an eagle straight down. Your spin kick is replaced with a down strike. That would have been helpful because I'm aerodynamic and endomorph. So what was that, Amanda? That's where you said I have like I don't know muscles and bones. Small, big muscles, small muscles. And we got 360 gold. We're gonna level up this health a little bit. We have 170 left, which is just not quite enough to do a whole lot of anything. Oh, we can get we can get a new character. We can get the barbarian. Nice. Robin Hood. I did hard, I did terrible with Robin. I don't know if you were here for that one, Ryan, but the, the knight was or the, the archer was not a, or the ranger was not my guy. Oh, we're a, we're a barbarian now, so we get to check this out. I guess whenever you unlock a character, you get to become a character for the next turn. So we're gonna get this one. We'll give this one one last good go. How about that? So guys, please hit that like button if you're around. It helps us out an awful lot. I'd really appreciate it. Um, like I said, this game is available on uh, on Xbox and PC. I believe it's $24.99, but I think these games go on sale quite a bit, and you'll find them for $19.99 quite often if you just look around. Ooh, this guy hits it's like a tank. What is that? What's that little spin thing? Oh, that? Oh, okay. Okay. I understand how this works. I think this might be my new guy. Ooh, and we already get... Twin incandescent telescopes. This will cost us 50 resolve, which I don't really know what that means. Choose this relic to reveal its power. So, I guess we gotta pick these up to figure out what they do. So this one costs 50, this one costs 35, we'll go with the 50 cost. Neely, I think Ryan needs a, uh, he's needed a system to play for every Father's Day since I've known him. I think, I think, I think Neely needs a system. She just doesn't know. Oh, that nice. Where did he come from?
don't feel bad about that one. I don't feel that one I do. That one I do. My brain. My brain is just brain? Brain? No. It didn't feel right when I did it. somewhere we're getting somewhere loading screen uh, let's see oh you know what this must be this must be when we have to get we have to progress so far into the game and we'll get separate ability like in uh, I don't know if you guys are familiar with the Metroidvania game but we'll get some kind of skill like a super jump or some wings or something like that we can fly up there and we can continue on with the game but this is just the first level but we probably won't get any of that until we uh, reach a, reach a boss of medium so okay, this thing, this thing. lots of little things cooking barbarian getting it for sure 15 resolve so we have eight sword again we've seen that before or the serrated handles bargain Let's give that a go I love how this guy runs. He like runs with like such momentum and kind of stuff. Like he's just head head first, hard charging it. Scared of nothing. Alright. Didn't think that was gonna get me. Didn't think that was gonna get me. Alright, we're gonna run one more back. One more back. You guys hit that like button, let me know. We got one more. One more, and we'll call it. All in. All in. Oh, we must have progressed somewhere. Enter the golden doors. Your kingdom demands it. Nice. Here we go. Barbarian, knight, or ranger. We're going barbarian. All day. All right, guys. Last run. Last run. Still can't afford much. Whatever. Look at him run! Look at him run! Love it! He has the best run animation out of all of them, for sure. Barbarian's next. He's by. I, I feel the best with him, just because he has this thing. That seems like No. Bad. Thought that first one would get him. Alright, here we go. Dude, you shoot things. Fair enough.
Heading down. It probably did say compulsive disorder. Like, they have some weird ones. Like I said, the vegan one, whenever you eat a health item, health, health item like a piece of chicken, it hurts you. Oh, no. What is this? Who's this guy? Heading down to the deep below. Be careful. Overconfidence can be lethal. Boy, do I know it. Uh, even estuaries won't venture any further without a sun lamp. Okay. Need a lantern. Okay. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not real worried about it. Why would I be? We're, we're heading down. Oh, no. Alright, so we'll head back in. Not been up. Ooh, a little hidden chest up here. Floaty. Best ever do it. Defeat all enemies. Well, that sounds great. Okay. This may be where it ends. But have some faith. I had a blast. Like I said, I know this isn't everybody's genre. I thought I might introduce you guys to something a little more my speed, something that I enjoy. I will definitely be sticking with this game for quite some time. It's one of those games that takes takes somebody like me many, 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 many hours to get good at. But I, I think we made some improvement along the way. So, again, I want to wish all of the moms out there a happy, happy, happy Mother's Day. I know I'm a couple days off, but still, I mean it from the bottom of my heart, not because anybody asked me to. The things you guys do, we appreciate you. I love my mother, um, and I love all the mothers that uh, are surrounding me in, uh, in, in my life. So, uh, if you didn't get a chance to, hug a mom tomorrow whenever you wake up, first thing. Um, and like I said, a special thanks to all the uh, the military spouses out there, as well as the uh, the moms that made little soldiers like me, and uh, the moms that served themselves. So, thank you so much. Please keep keep an eye on those uh, links in the description. I can't tell you this was a great week for links. Uh, so I'm super proud of the ones that are in there, especially those LG gaming monitors and that that that. 27 inch iMac with retina display fantastic idea please go to shopmyexchange.com slash verify if you do have an account uh, tell somebody else that doesn't about it it's a fantastic opportunity for them it's something that uh, is near and dear to my heart so I appreciate it so 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 very much um, but I guess until uh, I'll see you guys next week uh, same every Tuesday night right here at 7 o'clock uh, we'll try and uh, look at what we need to do to put up a poll. So I couldn't tell you what in the game we're going to play next week. Um, maybe that Hot Wheels Unleashed um, that I have. Um, but we'll, we'll try and put up a poll. I'll get with Christine and see what we can do. 
and uh, figure that piece of it out. But thank you so much for everyone who came out and uh, supported the stream. You can always find this um, this stream. It'll be pinned after the show, but you can always look through our videos. And check out some of our other lives as well. I'm not the only one here doing things either. Uh, Roy Montez every Monday is doing a fantastic 30-minute uh, workout. Uh, he's an expert in his field, so check him out Mondays at 11, uh, right here on Facebook. Uh, tomorrow, we have a Beauty Live with uh, Philosophy, and that's always a good time. And then we, uh, we always have you know Chief Chats and Beauty Lives, and I'll be here every Tuesday at 7 Central Time, just playing some video games, talking about veteran stuff, talking about video games, and talking about the exchange. So that's pretty much what we're all about here. So until next time, guys, I appreciate you so much. Uh, so have a good night. Hug your mothers first thing tomorrow when you see them or whenever you see them next. And uh, we'll see you next time. Appreciate it. Bye, guys.